welcome everybody and I am so excited. I know everybody knows what this weekend is. Oh my goodness, the premiere of Black Panther. It is finally time. The movie of the year, no doubt, hands down. So I definitely want to get into the movie, the premieres, a lot of talk around it. Uh, this weekend premiering um, today in certain cities, yesterday in certain cities, East Coast, West Coast, depending where you are. So that is our discussion of the day. The Black Panther, actually more specifically, the request of the 25% of the petition that is going around about the surrounding the movie. So let's get right into it. I have um, on the panel today our um, awesome guests. And you guys, if you want to no. dive right in, go right ahead. It's your boy, Rodney. Go ahead, Rodney. No, no, no. This is Rodney. Introduce yourself. Oh, real you know, quick. everybody know me, man. I'm John, you know. You know, old host, you know. Old, old, the old ho. Old the host. Best. Old ho. Oh, 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 I So, you know, we, you know, we want to hear your views on the whole Black Panther petition. <coughs> 25%, Rodney. Let's, let's jump in. First and foremost, okay. I think that is ridiculous. Mm. As do I. And I... To, to 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 try and take a movie that has all this hype, all this you know, black unity, black power. Mm -hmm. It's not uh, exactly about that, but the concept. Everyone's black. You know what I'm saying? It's right. a lot of black actors, right. a lot of black Hollywood, which is awesome to see. To try and take from that and say, hey, you need to put that back into the community. Why now? You know what I'm saying? Right. Why now? Are Why gonna, not? Are, are, is the white community going to do that with like Avengers when the Infinity Gauntlet comes out, Infinity Wars, mm -hmm. the one that's coming out this summer? Mm -hmm. Do they have to invest twenty five percent back into white businesses? I mean, they wouldn't need to. If, but I'm just like, saying, like, is there a petition it, for that? Like, why can't they just live? Well, shit, why can't they invest in the black community? Shit, I wouldn't care. Hey, the, I would be happy. But the Fox you know. said it's a good idea. And I just think she also that's thought dating Fifty Cent was a good idea, so her right. credibility down the drain. Right, that's pretty. I'm sorry, I'm but sorry. you know, I mean, well, you know, we say anything when the checks are rolling in, so right, just to be relevant. But I don't know. Twenty first off, twenty five percent is a big is a lot. lot of money. That's a lot. Right. If it's a hundred million dollars, which we already know, it's way right. more than that. But just for the sake of numbers, right. because you can't count. Why would you want? It. If it's a hundred mil. That's 25 mil right. that you're going to divvy up to, first off, what community? How do you know, you know, what I'm saying? How like, you know they're not reinvesting already in the black true, community? True, you know true. I'm saying? True. How do you know proceeds of this movie isn't already going back? Like, we don't know where they shot that at. Right. I seriously doubt they went to Africa. Right. Might have. There's no Wakanda, as exactly. everyone knows. Yeah, I, hope, I hope you guys yes. know that. There's Spoiler no alert. Wakanda's not a real country. <laughs> Thank you for spoilers. In Africa. <laughs> and I don't even know if it's a spoiler alert, because if you but, know that... Yeah, it's sad, but... It is what it is. But... 25%. That, you know what I'm saying? That's 25 mil if you got $100 million. First Ooh, off, what course. community are you putting that in? Second right. off, how do you determine which community to put it in? Is it going to go across the country? Is it you know what just going to go to one city? Yeah, like, maybe there are... Like you said, they might already be putting back in the places that they've shot, used, you know, for mm -hmm. the scenes... I think, and then it's on change.org. So me and you, for those who don't know, we could, anyone out there could go there and start a petition and try and get enough people to sign it. They could get a million signatures by tomorrow. And I do not think that anyone should give them 20, anyone not 25 think. percent. Nothing. No, no. Not you can't think. take from that. Would you, would you want to, because uh, I see you're a big Black Panther fan, you're very excited about yes. coming out. Would you want them to give 25 percent back to the black community by petition, not by their own accord? No, because, I mean, for me personally, it would just not seem genuine, and we don't know what the producer, actors, or whoever is involved are already donating and giving to. So for someone to feel obligated because it's a black movie right. is just wrong. Like, you don't why know. Don't, you know, well, exactly. Why don't you, why, they never asked 25% of Tyler Perry movies. Right. Or any of these other or, black or right. suggestively, if that's the case, that have all of black successful people exactly. give a one percent mm -hmm. into a pot and we all give, you know, what yeah. we can towards black yeah. community. I don't feel like one 
particular movie that we all know is going to be fun this weekend right. at the box office should be targeted like hey do this this is what you need to do like we are all here for jobs and to get paid so you can't count somebody else's dollars and say hey this is what you need to be doing because you're not with the already involved in and 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 for those me and i don't know if it's up uh, me and al last week it goes a little deeper in my book me and al last week had a one-on-one -on -one, me and him because you were sick and we were just me and him and we did our thing i don't know if we have it up but we will put it up after this okay we had we got into the conversation where as as african americans why do we feel the need to feel like if you open up a restaurant right now right i guarantee you there would be some family members or, or friends of yours or myself or yourself who would say hey man i'm gonna come up there and hook me up give me some shit for free and that's the same thing like just because this movie's about to make millions and millions and millions of dollars why do we feel that we need to take off the top for Certain black people, um, it's sad, uh, just feel obligated. They feel entitled. Uh, not obligated, excuse me. They feel entitled, like, hey, uh, you're doing X, Y, and Z. We're going to target you. And sometimes uh, it's sad, of course, in our black community, your success makes you a target. And that's what I was. we were saying that last week. And I just don't, I just think that's, that's so terrible because I've seen, <clears throat> you know, I have friends every race, different races. I've seen a, one of my white friends, they opened up a restaurant, mm -hmm. and his friends came in, and we spent more money there than we would anywhere else just because we know where it was going. Right. We don't get that same kind of love in the no. community. Instead, we want money from the restaurant, or we want shit for free, or a movie right. for that case. I just don't agree with it, and I think they should be ashamed of themselves. For real. Whoever, the, the, however many people signed it or, or started or thought of it should be ashamed of themselves like come on i think vivica fox should be ashamed of herself she would be more ashamed because you know vivica fox has been in a lot plenty of plenty of black movies right plenty of black yeah movies. and, and they never her checks. exactly like, they never was like vivica we need 25 percent right. of your right. money to invest back in the black yeah movie. she was like to, hold on to right. yeah. exactly. i guarantee yeah. she was just like, an empire mm -hmm. we, hey we want 25 percent of your empire, empire right. check She's like, wait a minute, man. I'm back in Philly, which you guys right. say you're from in the show. Right. You know what I'm saying? What? I'm not right? even from Philly. Wait either. a minute. <laughs> yeah. That shit's not cool. That, like, that's one of those situations. Black or white. Right. Mm -hmm. Period. Right. That's one of those situations where you get to get the fuck out of here. Okay. Get the fuck out of here. So are either one of you guys going to the premiere or to go see it? I'm going to watch on bootleg. <laughs> I'm just bullshit. I'm just bullshit. But that is some black shit to do. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm just gonna exactly. get that shit on bootleg. I heard I'm I got fire to stick. be that shit. Right, so. yeah. No, I, I mean, fire, st like, fire stick. Right. I'm, yeah. a, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna wait a couple months. Okay, no, why, why, why would you movies. choose to wait a couple months? Because we don't know how to act in the movie theater. Mm. And I like to enjoy the movie. Go to oh, a well, you know what? That's go so funny. Go to a matinee. Go to a matinee. That is true, but I work. 12 to 9, so I can't go to a matinee. That's so well, funny because I've heard okay. other people, like, say what you're saying. Like, I'm not going. It's going to be, you know, too loud. That I, me, I'm more caught up in, like, supporting the whole uh, opening movement. And I'm taking my kids. So it's like a kids family. Kids don't bother me. It's a no, 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 no. I hope, I hope that what you're saying does not come true. Because, like, if I'm in a movie a theater full of, like, you know, loud mouth people, that's going to really be aggravating. Yes, so it is. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hope that, you know, like that it's going to be... It's going to be packed. And of course, I saw that on the screen. It's going to be very packed. Tickets, but. It's going to be very packed, and I'm just I'm just not... You're, you're going to get one or two ignorant people. And, and, and unfortunately, I hope they sit far enough in the back where you guys don't. Oh, it doesn't no. bother you. But you're... Be, be prepared. I think it's that it's going to be so much hype around the movie that we might have, like, extra security. It so hopefully be. that'll calm, you I know. know. I, you know what, though? I think we might have... You going to pull me out for talking? You know it's what? a previews. You no, know you know what? Like. I think we might have a Star Wars situation. Where have you guys ever... We're going to dress up? No, no. You ever... Oh. Uh, there, there will that's be, the case. I'll be go tomorrow. There will oh, be yeah, some niggas dressed up. Oh, yeah. Black, represent but black shit. Yes, exactly. You saw. But when you 
ever seen like in the theater at Star Wars it'd be loud, then when the lights drop, it'd be quiet. That's what's gonna happen. Have I you ever pray. been to the movie? I have been, been, we are there to watch the movie for they sure. Don't respect the king. I, I haven't been to a lot right. of Star Wars movies, but I did Okay, nerd moment. Uh, right. I was about to say you've been there. Not to Star Wars, uh, Harry Potter though. And, and and the chick behind us, it was previews, and one of my friends, she was on her phone, and the chick behind us, like, she leaned in and she was like, your phone is distracting. Right. And she's like, okay, I'm sorry. And she put it down, and then, like, you know, the movie was about to start. It got darker, but the real previews came on, mm -hmm. and she did it again, and the chick mm -hmm. leaned back, and she's like, I'm going to have to get security. Right. And like it's all, I'm like the only black person. So like, it's all you white people. Out. I'm just like yes. this. I'm like, this bitch is gonna get you put right. out. And right. I'm not <laughs> leaving. This is the last one. There ain't no more after this. So I'm you go wait in the right. car. Right. I don't know. Right. Don't be two and a half hours in the I car. hate that. I hate, I hate, I hate when we go to movies. I hate that we do that. I hate comedy shows. Like, that bothers me too. We went to see Mike Epps and like, you'd only caught every third joke. Because it was always that person who's like, get him, daddy! Screaming like, I'm like, dude, maybe I should get more expensive tickets. So, we, yeah. so we, oh, just, we just said we need like part. black people etiquette for like. We just need to know how to act. The movie theaters. Period. Yeah. Like, we need to know how to respect. We need to know how to act in public. And outdoor, right. I'm not right. saying you have to be a white person. I'm just saying. Whoa. When, no, <laughs> what, wow. is that? what is that? Right. You know, wow. what I mean by that is, you Jeez, know, right. white people, they don't really. Haha! Uh -huh, in the movie theaters, you go to a, a white movie and it's like they're more reserved. It's quiet. You don't hear shit. And then yeah, at the yeah, end, they stand up and clap. Yeah. Like, yeah. you know, I don't say we need to do that. I'm just saying we don't need to scream or. or it's all about self. What movie theater right. are you going to? Where go to it's like I only go to. Okay, so like when we agree that the 25 percent is wrong and that yes. it should not be taken no, from the so directors, anyone. the actors, Nobody. anybody who works hard. I'm Nobody. so excited about this weekend. Yes, Can't yes. wait to see the black movie. Panther. I think it's gonna be great. I suggest all black people support the movie. It's gonna be great. Go out and see it. And thank you guys for being on the show. <laughs> thank you for your opinions. And this has been today's no show. Problem, thank you guys sister. for tuning in. No problem, my queen. <laughs> <laughs>